hello friends welcome back to my channel so today i'm gonna show you how i made this cute hairstyle for my daughter so let's get started so guys this is a hairpiece that we're gonna be using today it's a soft red it's the color two so yeah i just um, I'm gonna be using only one packet. I'll cut it into half since it's a child. I don't want it to be longer. Then there's a styling gel that I'm gonna be using. As you can see, it's the first time I tried, but then it has the T3 oil. So I'll, yeah, that's why I'm interested in drying it. And then there's the crochet that we're gonna be using for the hairstyle and then there's a comb that i'm going to be using as well so this hairstyle is going to be quick guys it's just going to be a few hours yeah depends how fast you are but then it has to at least maximum it must be two hours so yeah i did wash her hair and did uh, blow dry it as well so now i'm going to go ahead and start opening the line going um from the uh, above the ear going to the other one just like this and then I'm gonna go ahead and apply the, um, the shining gem so yes guys this is shining gem or the styling gel that I'm gonna be using it's first time I'm going to be using it but I love the texture of it I just love how it feels and then it's it's very very easy to use like I just love I think I'm gonna use it on all of my videos I just love it so much guys and then I'm gonna go ahead and start applying it like this on my line and then I Now I'm gonna go ahead and use my comb just to um, perfect the a line that I just opened. So yes guys, on this channel you're gonna find a lot of kids cute hairstyles and as well as adults hairstyles that you can do it yourself at home. So yeah, now I'm gonna go ahead and start, um, um, I'm gonna plait this hair at the back like this just to get it out of the way. Then I'm gonna start plaiting uh, the front hair. I'm gonna start opening like obviously plating the small lines of the yeah like the corner hairstyle something like that yeah so i'm gonna go ahead and start applying the shiny gem again before starting to plait So yes guys, plating it has a lot of different ways, just within how you feel comfortable. But if you find this way more easier for you, then you can go ahead and do it the way I'm doing it or the way I'm plating it, just like I'm doing here. So now I'm gonna, yeah, I'm gonna just play the small lines at the front. And then for the back part, I'm planning to play the big lines. It doesn't have to be perfect since it's a back. And then over there, that's where we're going to be using our crochet to install the hair or the hair piece that I just showed you earlier on. So 
So guys, like now I'm opening the second line and I'm gonna go ahead and start braiding. Most of the um the the braids I'm gonna do it um off camera because I don't wanna make this video very long for you guys. I uh, want to make it as short as possible yet informational. Please, if you like a videos like this, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Help us reach uh, 1k subscribers. This channel is very new, guys, as you can see. But I promise to be uh, sharing with you guys um, amazing videos how you can uh, play to your child at home and also how to pledge yourself at home. I'll be showing easy hairstyles yet cute. So thanks, thanks for my subscribers and everyone who's been supporting my channel. Thank you so much. Like I said, guys, there's a lot of methods to uh, to plait or to braid. Just use any method which you feel comfortable with. But if you find this easier for you, then you can go ahead and use the same method that I'm using at the moment. So I believe in um, like enjoying the process, of enjoying what you do. That's why you can just go ahead and use the method which you feel comfortable with.
to me is going to some time now with um, the plant part so now I'm going to go ahead and go play the back part yeah it's just going to be the large place there and as you can see now I'm done I'm ready to install so yes like I said the back part it doesn't need to be perfect at all it just has to be um you yeah, just have to make sure that it's um, secured enough for it to uh, to last longer. So now I'm gonna go ahead and take the hairpiece, and then I'm gonna cut it in the middle because I don't want the hairstyle to be too long for her, or very long for her with the length. Just want it to to reach to the shoulders. So I'm gonna go ahead and cut it just like this, and then. I'm going to show you the next step thereafter. So now I'm going to go ahead and take my crochet and then the hairpiece. And then I'm going to take this small uh, section from that and then um, and I'm going to start installing the hair. You want to make sure that you don't take um, a large uh, uh, large sections because if you do then it's gonna um, it's not gonna last longer so you just have to take medium size or small size and then make sure that um, the this thing everything is secure so the hairstyle can last longer and then I'm just gonna go ahead and repeat the same process. So as you can see guys, I'm trying to um, make the curls to look a bit smaller so they can look cute on her. So yeah. So now I'm gonna carry on and do the same process. Install the hair and then make sure that it's secured. And then, and then I'm just gonna make the curls to um just gonna make the curls to be loose like this, so it can look as natural as possible. I'm gonna repeat the same process guys, just like this and then uh, most of the work I'll do it off camera and then I'm gonna come back and show you the finished look and then guys, please if you enjoyed the video, let me know, comment down below, please please give me the thumbs up and if you are new to my channel don't forget to um subscribe as you can see after using the crochet to um, this thing to install the hair i make sure that i tie the knot if it's loose i make sure that i tie the knot so the hair can last longer and yes guys you're gonna still make mistakes somewhere but then like over here I guess I did a mistake but then I went ahead and corrected that and then I carry on with what I was doing like I said um, I'm gonna do um, only few and thereafter most of the work I'll do it off camera and then I'm gonna come back and show you the finished look guys And yes guys make sure that um, you fill in all the spaces so yeah you make sure that you fill in all the spaces and then yes guys I'm gonna show you and now I'm going to the last line and then I'm gonna continue installing and then yeah guys this is the finished look thanks for watching Please don't forget to subscribe. Bye.